Hi, I'm Kevin with Speakflow, the online teleprompter. In this video, I want to show you how you can create and edit your scripts with Speakflow. I'll go over all the basics from creating your first script to formatting text for your teleprompter presentation. When you first log in to Speakflow, you'll see the script management page. This page shows all the scripts you've personally created. With a new account, the only script you'll see is the README demo script. If you need to edit an existing script, you can simply click on its title or open the drop down and click edit. So let's go ahead and create a new script. There are a few ways you can do this from the script management page. You can click on new script here, here, and if you're on mobile, there's a button here in the scripts drop down menu. Once you create a new script, you'll see the script editor page. If you plan on writing your script directly into Speakflow, you can click where it says enter your script here and simply start typing. If you're using flow mode or voice recognition scrolling, you'll want to make sure that your script is set to the correct language or dialect so that it can recognize your words during your presentation. We currently support English of various dialects, as well as Brazilian Portuguese, Dutch, French, German, Italian, and Spanish. If you already have your script written in another word processor, you can also copy paste directly into Speakflow. You can also import a .pdf or .x file. I'll import our demo script as an example. Whatever you title your script will show up on the script management page. On the left hand side, you'll see some basic formatting options. You'll also notice that if you highlight any text, it will also show you the formatting options along with a couple other options that we'll get to in a moment. You can toggle formatting on and off by highlighting the formatted text and clicking on the format buttons. If you have a studio plan, you'll have access to our built-in AI assistant that can help you rephrase, simplify, or correct the grammar of your script. Simply highlight the text you want to edit, select the option you'd like, and decide whether you'd like the selected text to be replaced or inserted after what you've highlighted. You'll also notice an option to wrap your text in brackets. Brackets will tell the teleprompter to skip certain phrases if you're presenting your script in flow mode. Brackets are a great way for acting prompts, placeholder words like say name here, and proper nouns that speech recognition might not recognize. You'll notice that every time I make a little change, Speakflow will automatically save the revision history for the script. You can open the dropdown for any date to see who made the revision and when. When you click revert, you'll see a preview for that version of the script and you can click revert to swap it for the selected revision. If you need to delete a script, you'll find the trash icon in the bottom right hand corner of the screen. You'll be prompted to confirm as deleting your script is permanent. Once you're ready to present, simply click on the button in the bottom left hand corner and you'll be taken to the presentation screen. If you need to edit the script, you can click on edit directly from the presentation screen in the upper right hand corner. And that's how you create and edit scripts in Speakflow. Thanks for listening and good luck with your presentation.